I'm still mad at you, Steve. I'm, I'm pointing at, at the camera. I'm mad at you. We I'm not mad at you. I'm mad at him. And that's Stevie. Another year, another Missouri game. Con for you. Don't want this on the channel. Look, look, what, look. You can't leave it up. I can't. What about you, Bubby? It's gonna be great. And Ron. It's gonna be magic. Okay. Whoa. Okay. I'm ready. My body is ready. All right, Bubby. I'm gonna let you choose a couple things right <sighs> now. What's the things we choose? Where would you like to eat this evening? Here we go. Oh. Your choice. Wait, it's one o'clock. I don't, I don't even know. This evening. That... What do you want? Just to be spiteful, like Stevie does. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I say it's on John Silver's. <laughs> you yeah. are in a nasty grease pit. The cesspits of, of what Bubby would say, hell. You mean mugs up? No! <laughs> <laughs> that thing's gonna get tomahawked or something else in a few days. My hitman on him right now. <laughs> Use a Molotov cocktail. I'll let you pick. It's a three he day He just did pick. Sir. Okay, that's what you want to do? Do what? What was your favorite part of the trip? Leaving. <laughs> Thank you for your time. <laughs> oh, hello. My children. My lamb. To my heart. Wow, this is really strange, isn't it? Isn't it ironic that we're actually filming something in recent memory? Isn't it? Isn't it though? Friday we uh, we had a, a bonding time that was extravagant, beautiful. You know, this is the way normal people do. This is what normal YouTubers do, right? We've been to four of them now, four in a row. Connect Four, it's a really good game. St. Charles, Missouri, kind of the same location, same location as it was last year. Bubby, you're the only cutie I see. Oh, oh, training game. Yeah, it's, it's great, you should go there. <laughs> Why are you mad Look, at Look, it's me, I'm going to sneak out. I'm 13 year old Stevie and 15 year old, <laughs> I mean, Bubby. <laughs> Look, it's me, I'm going to sneak out under Tony's watch. Something kind of special. We had a sponsorship table, so we're gonna sell some, well, hold on, excuse me. I'm gonna sell some games. Ronnie! But we're actually gonna go and stay the night uh, beforehand and kind of hang out, because we want to get up a little bit earlier to go set up for uh, the vendor booth that we have, vendor table. So Tony's plan was to drive there Friday, the night before, the day before the con, and have a hotel, stay the night there, and then go to the con Saturday morning. But then come home Saturday night, and come back Sunday. So that doesn't make any sense. You still have to set up Saturday this day? Yeah, but I wanted to get up earlier so I could get you there. You can still get there at the same time. You just get up earlier. I don't earlier. want to get up that early. Then you sleep earlier too. Oh my gosh, is this what it's gonna be? Is this what this episode is going to be about? Arguing? Oh wait, that's like every episode. So you guys, uh, so 
Are you mad already? Yeah, at you. For what? Everything. What did I do? Well, what? first of all, you didn't get the freaking episode out today. That upset me more than anything. Second of all, you're out there in the car talking to Maya. Look at me talking to Maya. <laughs> Criticizing me six years ago. Now it's more like a classroom. <laughs> <laughs> they sit down, they're in their seats, and they get a grade. If I can close up the table and enjoy the con tomorrow, I will. You know? So. We, have, we have a table. Oh, you did? Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's okay to have a table, but then you're stuck. Then that's how I know. Today's all about yeah. him. Okay. Oh, it's about me today? Yeah. Happy birthday, Bubby. Oh, thanks. You're two, mi two months early. <laughs> Tony, what do you think about Bubby? I have a serious hetero man crush on him. <laughs> this is gonna be her first her first con, so she's super nervous, guys. Yeah. I'll get it on my my best videos are just like off the cuff and just talk and just yeah. have fun. And then when I tried to do like a script and like we remember stuff to say, as a set. Oh, you are? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because I'm trying to just get the set gone this cheap for the set. No, that's all I have is those. Oh, okay. I was looking for the Sonic. Card. Everybody is Sonic or Tails. Is or it like a knockoff? Uh. No, it's not. It is. It's vintage air stuff. Um, um, but it's not. It's like Genesis. It's see the font. It looks like Game Boy Color. So it's a like Game Boy Color error. But it's a portable Famicom, um, and it's it's imported, and it's terrible. It's terrible. Who else are you gonna freaking call? Oh this God. isn't. This isn't. Let's call and make fun of Tony Trip. Say the Optimus Prime line. Thought you were made of sturdier stuff than this. That thing sells. Hey, there's a quick stop. Don't go. No, <laughs> no, I don't want to die. Turn left. Or 7-Eleven. No. 7-Eleven's good. No. Turn right. How do you Just not like 7-Eleven? Only Red Surge. <laughs> Flip! I'm not gonna put the link wig and hat on. And why not? Hey, I don't want to put your fool in there. Art. Finally get that, you know, Jonas Brothers poster you've been wanting. Shh. Did you just shush Ron? You wanna go to QT? Ow! <laughs> Do you, Tony? Not really. There's humanity so... The red surge is the, the yeah. devil. Uh, oh, the red the surge. The devil land. What are we doing after this? What do you want to do? It's full. <laughs> <laughs> no answer. The blood. Tony! Of salvation. I need water. You need red surge. Quick trip. I need red surge. Red surge is the devil. The, the blood of salvation. Tony, I want a quick trip and I want it now. You know what? We're working on it. Bubby wants it right now too. <coughs> I want everything right now. You hear that? He wants everything right now. Are you gonna get it for him? Whatever Bubby wishes Bubby gets. Whatever it takes. <laughs> Bobby, why are we getting hyped for QT? Because the, the blood of salvation is about to hit us. You're such a snob. You know that? Oh. Uh -huh. There's mold? Are we gonna die? 
Is anybody allergic to mold? That's like really fresh too. Why are you touching it? Why are you smelling no, it? No! I don't want to go to video game stores. <laughs> I want to go eat. I don't really want Who cares about GameStop? <laughs> it's the same crap every day, every month. Every year. Every year. Whoa. I'm using this shit. <laughs> we all are. I didn't get one last year. Because we didn't pay BFE. Woo. No, he didn't buy the shirt. He wasn't with us when we Yeah, we were shirt. blood brothers last year. Yeah. No, you weren't. We both bought shirts. No, he left several times while I stuck with you. <laughs> Remember? But we're still blood During brothers. During the interviews, you were even like, you did good, see. You did good. You stayed with me. But we're still blood brothers. A cup, you know. <laughs> Since you're paying, they have to share? Yep. We gotta share a soda. <laughs> How about no, Scott? <laughs> it doesn't matter nasty. what it is, as long as he, even if he picks it, he's accomplished. gonna whine about it. This is nasty. You might have a two-hour late lunch, maybe not. Maybe if we would have gone earlier. Texas, freaking Roadhouse. Texas Roadhouse is disgusting in my opinion, and I could cook a better steak in my backyard. It's not disgusting. It's not disgusting, but it's inferior to my it's steaks. It's expensive. It's inferior to my steaks. Make sure you guys look at the menu. You know what you want to order. Goes. Ooh, they got macaroni and cheese. We could probably fashion a taco somehow, right? I think we can. Are you enjoying your food? I am. I'm not drunk. Taco crunch. He put him back on. <laughs> so in Bubby's in heaven, I let him choose where we were gonna eat because I was throwing him a bone before the sacrifice. The sacrifice of the tacos. But we'll get to that, Stevie. Texas Longhorn. To Texas Roadhouse. Roadhouse is God's place in America. That place is abundance of joy, happiness, confusion, and loud music. I hate that place. It's really loud, isn't it? Because there was birthday parties going on and I couldn't even watch them. See a shirt. Uh, I want to watch the birthday parties. Would you I was trying to get you the experience, the Texas Roadhouse experience. If there's a taco mayo closer to us, anime is great. Just wait, wait for the devil land. <laughs> Just wait for the rock bottoms tonight, boy. Ronald's having fun. So he's like, yeah, look at him. He looks like he's having the time of his life. It's like so much fun. Like, hey, can I have that camera? No. Please? All right, Get buddy. your little steak out! What? Oh. I liked Texas Roadhouse. That was fun. All my um, friends and I... <laughs> Bubby may have had a, too many Jolly Ranchers. It's Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> On this slightly disgruntled edition of the Cup Chasers. Let me get that for your dad. So dumb, I hate Cup Chasers now.
Oh no, we have a special special guest. Ronnie. Welcome to the Cup Chasers. Wait, you guys are here too? Bubby? I mean, <laughs> Cup Chaser person? <laughs> oh lord. Freaking pasta. Uh, he's punch drunk love. <laughs> The really bad Adam, Adam Sandler movie. I'm gonna call you Uncle Uncle Bubby. That's what they're gonna <laughs> call me. Uncle Stevie, Uncle Ronnie. So how involved can we be? In what? In uh, your future children. <laughs> can we babysit? I can't babysit. <laughs> you're not babysit, Bubby. You're not. <laughs> you are not influencing my children. I'm not gonna influence your children. I'm just gonna put our ideas in their heads. <laughs> That's exactly what it <laughs> is. It's me. Tell them about the summer market. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Here, no, There's vintage stock. Oh, oh, that was a bomb. Thank you. This edition of the Cub Chasers. Ooh, a cactar. Final Fantasy. There he goes. He zooms ahead. Yeah. I didn't sleep well last night. You never sleep. <laughs> really, it's true. Wait, but what is it? Tickets? Do you think quarters? Yeah, quarters. When the stars at night are big and bright, deep in the heart of Texas. All right, I'll do it, but make me sad. The stars at night are big <laughs> and bright, deep in the heart of Texas. <laughs> that does make me want to cry. I only sing to Mom's myself and myself. Sing the song. Turn left onto the ramp. Oh, no. I might kill you. The big and night. Oh crap, I forgot my charger downstairs. What have you done? I've done Nightmare says the unthinkable. Are you changing? Yeah. You go swimming? Yeah. Oh, can you wait for me? No. Are you gonna go down there without me? Probably. Just okay. wait! There's a Taiwanese family down there. <laughs> what? what? you don't want to go? I'm going! Can you... I just got in here. You better hurry up. <laughs> what? Hi, Stevie. What? You remember when Bubby <laughs> and I... Well, we didn't share a bed, did we? No, but I, I remember. <laughs> it's gonna happen. You're gonna lose, and then you're gonna you're cry about can it. Can I go get changed? No. Yeah, you can. Party like it's 1968. Oh, no. Bubby and I, we decide to go for a little swim in the pool. And we decide to have a little wrestling match. Because The Rock is here. That's how it goes, right? If you smell what The Rock is cooking. Rock bottoms served. You're not touching me. Oh, really? Man, your ass feet are so white. Yeah, this is the tennis tan. <laughs> Seriously, I get made fun of all the time. No, no, no. no you don't get made fun of for that, though. Go underwater. What's he doing? Mm. Do you think it was funny? I did.
did. I thought it was funny. This is how funny I thought it was. <laughs> you and Ronnie were laughing hysterically. Oh, yeah. That's why I couldn't keep the cameras. I was like, because I was laughing. So. Texas to his snoring. I was gonna ask him about Texas. Nope. That's first. Nope. Now here's the funny thing though. So Bubby actually got me out of the pool and threw me. And after you left, Stevie, you and Ronnie left. I got Bubby in the pool too. But there's no footage. There's, there's no, no it's, footage. You we we had a tie. We had a tie. Count. Nope. Oh, Bubby it wins. was a tie. Bubby wins. So here's the deal. If we were on a wrestling mat, Oops. Bubby would here, be here destroyed. Go, Stevie and I decided to play a chess match. <laughs> I keep telling people about this story. What what story? That you wanted to play chess for so long and then it all ends up in a stalemate. <laughs> so if I would have made one freaking move, I would have won. Okay? That's all there is to it. I screwed up and we had a stalemate. The end. Yeah. I'm better at chess than Stevie. I actually would have beat him, but I was tired that day and I was I tired. Was... I was exhausted. <laughs> I like to snore, apparently. You like to? <laughs> I like to you snore. You enjoy the act of I snoring. enjoy it. it is a it's a pastime of mine. I do it every day if I can. And I apparently no one could sleep. So, uh, it was like 4 a.m. or something. I, I actually had to get up and take a leak. I, I go, like, walk towards the bathroom in the hotel room, and there's a light on in the bathroom. I'm like, oh, you know, Bubby's using the, the restroom or whatever. I hear bath water running. And I'm like, this is really weird. So, apparently, Bubby is taking a bath at 4 a.m. because he can't sleep, and he's watching anime. These are going to be long interviews. Yes, they are. Wait, me and it's Ronnie here. are... Chocolate cut. shake together in one cup. <laughs> I'm going by myself with Bubby next year. My plan was to go down and eat breakfast because I woke up before everybody else. Sort of. I mean, Bubby was at 4 a.m. taking a bath. Uh, and go eat breakfast and then come back up so that I could be ready to get footage of everything. I like to eat breakfast together at these events. Are you up for the snoring, Steve? You know what, Steve? <laughs> you know it's a tradition that we eat breakfast together. Nothing but a jerk. And Bubby in his freaking bath. Why did you take a bath, Bubby? Because I couldn't sleep. I was mad. And I wanted to do something different. Because this idiot needs his, nostril, his nose erased from his body, freaking suffocated with a pillow. There's an alternative option. I, could, I haven't took a bath in like years. I can experience childhood again. Anime Watching and Dragon Ball Z. And a bath though. We're gonna leave for the con, go set up for the con. I have a ton of crap. And Ronnie, Stevie, Bubby help us out. Jason from Trading Games. Is it Trading Games or Game Trader 2? Trading Games. He actually lets us borrow one of his hand carts and we get all our stuff in there. I'm mean, eating breakfast by myself. Something for you too. Hold on. Wait a minute, I know you. I know you guys. <gasps> <laughs> Suck it, Stevie. It's not the gold controller. A gold controller. No. I thought it was funny that you get a lesser, lesser version. A cheap. 
a ripoff, Version. some might say, a, a downgrade. downgrade. <laughs> Jinx. Whilst I still have the main prize in, in my hand. You, you stole it out of my hand. Well, thank you, hey dad. You gave me that gold controller, that Wii controller. Stevie, go suck an egg. The timeline's coming. No, it's not. It'll be corrected. I set up my booth, my table, and people are actually starting to come. As soon as we're done setting up, there's literally people coming up to our table. It's not even time for the early bird session, I guess. Joseph Ross, he's another vendor, Cerulean Games. We actually have some footage of him on our channel. Some point, some Missouri Game Con. I don't even remember. Probably two. Anyway, um, he comes up and he's actually wanting to buy some games off of me early. I actually end up selling my personal copy of Earthbound. Believe it or not. Well, and you are a terrible coach. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't even tell him to say that. How you been, man? Good, man. How are you? Not bad. Not bad at all. Off he's me. buying Earthbound. <gasps> That's your Earthbound going away, Tony. Last chance. You can keep it. Oh, man. Are you sure? I'm getting itchy. Exactly. Sure. Get into my man pouch. <laughs> Are you having fun? Too much. Bubby, are you having fun? Yeah, you that sucker. Are you ready? <laughs> hey, Dad. Let's play. Gosh dang it. <laughs> well, did you bring your own TV? Yeah. That's free if you want it. I'm not hauling it back. <laughs> No. <laughs> first, first purchase of the con, probably first, only. Yeah, probably the only <laughs> one. Shut up, this Steve. Be the most boring con ever. Shut up, Steve. Ever. Now we're game hunting. Like Let's go. Uh, I'm giving it up. What Steve. are we looking for? I'm looking for a swift punch to your face. <laughs> look, look. Excellent work. I did not get to experience this con like I have in the past. I actually, what, like I said, I was selling games. I was literally at my table from the time the con opened to the time the con closed. And there were quite a few people that came up to my booth. I got to talk to a lot of neat people, a lot of cool YouTubers. Pat, I got to talk to Pat for a while. Pixel Dan, that was awesome. And there was, there was also quite a few other YouTubers gaming off the grid. They were there. Do you nerd Captain Algebra? I got to talk with all of them and and actually sell a few games to them. And uh, just a lot of cool people coming to my table. I actually talked to more people this year than I ever have. And that was kind of my goal of getting the booth, to getting the table, is that I wanted to connect with more people. And it was amazing. It was absolutely amazing. Where is his SpongeBob? Where is his SpongeBob toy? <laughs> Tell you what, if the Perler lady has a SpongeBob, I'll get it for you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> what do you truly think about Hey Dad, Let's Play? I would brag with him if he would allow me. He still owes me a SpongeBob toy. I'm looking for that still. Jay from the Game Chasers was there. That's a new. Well, and Pat, and Norm. None of them were there. Any of them was there? Mine. Those are all new people. You know what you could do? You could hold the camera while I do this. Dang it. You could write it 
on a retro Tony card, and then you can take one for yourself. How much are the shirts? Uh, fifteen for the shirts. I got I got all sizes on this one, limited on on the rest. Though. What size do you wear? Uh, extra large. Extra large. Which one do you want? Uh, okay. the red one or the kind of thing. Red. What? The we were going to talk. We can get Pat the NES Punk to say it. Yeah, we got Billy freaking Mitchell. This game sucks. I was doing great. I was meeting people, watching panels, watching you idiots be stupid, hanging out with Ronnie Lynn in the van for most of the time. Because there was nothing else to do, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah yo, I was making money. Who cares? That doesn't. None of us care. Well, We're the ones that are there to work. Work in quotations. Oh, We're man. just there for entertainment. For the fans. Love to transform. Yes. Bubby. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> We wrestled in a pool last yesterday, and I took a shower in your bath. No, uh, I do. It's across yeah, the way. Yeah. All right. Yeah, he, he, Walter. Yes, he has some plastic canisters that he plans on. Yes. Bring them to me when you're done. Now, one notable, Walter Day. We have actually met Walter in the past. We went to Icon in Ottumwa, Iowa. It's our very first Retro on the Bubby episode. And I, I just have one thing to say about Walter. He is such the nicest guy. Good. Could you sign my card? Dude, that's his own card. This is the big deal. This is a historical individual here. He's not just an other vendor here at the show. He's secretly, secretly a major, major video game icon who actually is on a trading card. This trading card will be will be collected and honored and revered and people will be fascinated by the whole card set, no less your card set. So it's great to see you. Are yeah, great to see you. Gonna be here? What's that? Any of your students going to be here? Uh, actually, I think... follow your antics closely? Yes, they, they, they make fun of me <laughs> relentlessly. That's great. And they know about the card. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They got a hoot out of that. They love it, though. He said some really nice things about me. Thank you, Walter, for making that card for me. And uh, you're, you're just... You're such a nice guy. I really appreciate the time I got to spend with you and... And talk with you and and I really appreciate it so thank you the life the life events that happened on that trip What's walter day you? looked into my spirit you didn't experience walter's days panel like walter's i did walter's walter's <laughs> the new, new movie walter's, walter's days. days i learned about the asteroids <laughs> take care yeah Where's it at? Okay. Cool. I go next year. I totally woke up at like four in the morning for this in Kentucky time. So that's yeah, still like four in the morning. That sounds like fun. Yeah. Wait, you know Lucas outfit or no Nesson outfit tonight? This time? No, I, I we didn't pack it apparently, but I got the backpack. <laughs> because uh, we're here. Yeah, I, I tried to get Norm to say the Retro Tony was pretentious, but he wouldn't do it. Like, oh look, it's hit, it's gaming off the grid. Oh my god, we know these guys. Retro Tony's yeah. inside. Yeah, the heck, you guys don't get a card. No. <laughs> Missouri's favorite retro video gamer. YouTube. Don't let Norm hear that. I'll go over there and tell him right now. Hey, have you seen anyone dress up like Ness today? No. You haven't? We didn't bring the clothes. You know what I like? Is I can see the work somebody put into something. You, you it, Unlike when I watched one of your videos. I did not like that you, that you had a booth this year. Because it made it... We, I didn't have anything to do. Since those cons and stuff, I follow you around. 
the whole yeah, reason I'm I go not, there is to film. I didn't game hunt this year. I noticed, and I didn't have anything to do. You all are always messing with me about hoarding, and you know what? I was getting rid of crap. I'm keeping stuff. I'm not getting rid of all my stuff. I mean, there's like all those boxes out there too. We That's just... going to Missouri Game Con Five. Oh, and two like face towels. And if we can get. Tony, you know what's really pretentious? Calling other people pretentious. Don't do it. Oh no, yeah, yeah. I saw him outside. We're like, hey, it's gaming up the grid. Huh? Not you, Ronnie. It's so weird what you're doing right now. You can't get rid of Ron, move. Yeah. Jeez, Ronnie. <laughs> My man, how are you? Hey, how we doing? Good. Holy yeah, cow, you got a good uh, spread here. Yeah. yeah. So if you ever still come back to St. Louis again, I will bring it for you. Just okay. Let me know. It messes me. Like I said, my name is Brian Billionis. Yeah. I'm one of your subscribers. You'll see me. Sweet. Thank you. And we're in the same group anyway. Metro Gamer, St. Louis. Yep. Yeah. Oh, hey, me too. What's going on? Hey, how you doing? Adam. Uh, actually, since, then, since you're doing this, I'm going to buy this from you. Are you guys okay. take card? Right. I'll probably be back. I'm just going to look around. I hope you enjoy. I didn't see any jack in the boxes on the way here. Oh. Or else I would stop. They, we know where one's at. Are we getting Tony Jack in the box? Yeah, I and guess. And Bubby is tacos, and then we're just gonna get our own stuff. Yes. <laughs> Stevie is a freaking nerd. Stevie can just. I don't know what he's thinking. If I'm not attached to his hip, if I'm not like right there holding his little hand. He's gonna do something stupid. I know it. Like go to a tibia convention. Oh. What? <laughs> I wanted to do that after. What? What did he say? He said I wanted to do that after. So freaking Stevie has this bright idea. This really bright idea. Now I'm looking straight into his eyes. And I'm not afraid to look into his eyes now. Like in episode one or two or three. Stevie, I'm just gonna say this. No now I can't look into your eyes. Why did you buy the stupid tacos before we went to Jack in the Box? I want to know why. I want answers. I want to know why. You know why? Because you ruined my bit. I love Stevie. He's a, he made the sacrifice of the, of the year. <laughs> I'm going to put him in for the Emmy nomination. Oh, we can send lemonade. What was running through your little harebrained mind when you went to go buy Jack in the Box tacos? My plan was to save Bubby, because he does not deserve that. Bubby has been through enough, okay? He has been through enough with your new deals and agreements. Bubby's had enough, you know? I had to give those freaking tacos to Maynard and Joe. You know what? They ate those tacos and they were happy. They were like, man, these are so good and delicious. You know what I was doing? I was frowning, I was angry inside, and I wanted to punch a wall. Because Bubby and I, we got to eat those tacos after Missouri Game Con. That's tradition. That's what we do. I was happy. But Stevie, Stevie, look at me. You ruined it. I got My soul you. is at 25% right now. <laughs> What's it at now? It's at 35 35, that's a good improvement, that's good. <laughs> so I'm gonna have Jolly Rancher, one red Jolly, one Jolly. Missouri Game Con 4. This year I have an actual booth. Uh, are there any children in the audience? Okay, because we be honest. <laughs> Sign autographs. <laughs> I figured he just asks people. Yeah. Hey, is it okay if I sign an autograph for you? Actually, before you got here, that's what he said. Freaking 8 bit Brody. So he's actually, he was doing his normal Missouri Game Con bit, the trade up bit. And uh, watch his video, check it out. It's pretty funny. And he actually comes to our table quite a few times. So, but I was yeah. late on my games. So. I appreciate that, man. Yeah, another one. Another one. For the cause. Another one. I'll put it, I'll keep it close to my heart. My heart's on the other side from the other people. <laughs> okay. Title challenge. Wait. Draw a number from 
one to six forty five when we're okay. ready to do it. All right. So they're in the yard. Uh, so I brought my multiple to so right. somebody draw a number. Yeah, I like that. That's a good move. Uh, All right. Uh, Steven? Oh, you haven't even said hi to me yet, man. <laughs> Steven Lucas. <laughs> Steven Lucas. We, every year we got to have a Steven Lucas clip. We got to have Steven Lucas uh, in our Missouri GameCon experience. Pixel Dan. Pixel Dan. Yes. Huge man. Thank you so much. Love your work. I appreciate it. Thank you. So I work with autistic students yeah? in my high school. And when we have a little bit of downtime, we love watching your slime videos. Really? They, they, they ask for it. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Yeah, they absolutely love oh, it. Oh, that makes me feel so good. That yeah. is awesome. Yeah. So, Thank you very much. Appreciate the wholesome, you know, yeah. G-rated content. Hey, I man. love it. No, toys are for kids, right? Absolutely. All toys. So I try to make it fun for everybody. Absolutely. I'm a dad too, so I want to I want to make something that anybody can watch and enjoy. Uh, How are you guys What's doing? Up, I already talked to you. I wanted to give you some. Yay! Thank that's you. a special card that I don't give out to everybody. No. I have the no. chosen one. I'm not yes. sure how. I'm not sure how. You are a middle you. school teacher. You are a chosen one. Oh my gosh! Yes. Did you know she's a teacher? I did like not me? know that. I like am. me. <laughs> I actually run the gaming club at my middle school, and then during the summer, I teach history of video games and history of video game franchises. So uh, you guys sound a lot alike. So do I. Yeah. Hey, dude. What's that? Hey. Nice to see you in person. I heard you were calling me pretentious <laughs> earlier. What's that? It's not you. Some random person. <laughs> <laughs> Who it was. Wow, I didn't think I'd ever see you in real life. This is amazing. Yes? Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Real life. Real life now, yeah. right here. Oh. I bought that at some game store in Eldon, Missouri. Does it work? You yeah. try it? It does work? It's seven batteries, six batteries. You don't want this on the channel. <laughs> Forty dollars. Forty? What? This is like a sixty-five dollar game. It is? It is missing the manual. But it's an immaculate disc. What does that mean, Bubby? I mean I the search is over. My search is over. <laughs> <laughs> I got it just for you, literally. Thank God. I've been alive. And thank God and that's a, that's a positive. Uh, you can take that to GameStop right now and they wouldn't take it back because it's still sealed. Right, right. Uh, the prepaid hint card. Don't look at that though. We keep keep that uh we keep that right there. <laughs> good lord. He's really good at tasting games. Get a little lick. Very soft. <laughs> okay. okay. Let's get the disease off of it. Yes. <laughs> okay, so you're wanting to trade up. Yeah. This is this is a high dollar boy. I've been looking for it. Like yeah, that. Brody messed with us a, a bit, didn't he? I came at least like four or five times with that stupid bit. Most It's funny too, because twice it was like after you went somewhere and I was there alone. And I don't have enough knowledge to know what's, I don't care. So I was just, I was ready to give him <laughs> whatever, really whatever he asked for. I'm not giving him avenging spirit. I'm not giving that to him. No? Why not? Because. Why? For that? Because he's been so nice today. I, I, I know he has. I know he has. I, if, if you've legitimately been looking for Kingsfield, I want to get that in your hands, but it's got to be worth it. Wow, I actually feel like pressure. Aren't you just glad I'm here in general? Go suck an egg, Stevie. Did you know Brute Force? On the original Xbox was a launch title. That was in the giveaway pile, and someone was talking about it, and I was trying not to laugh. The con is coming to an end, and we're wrapping things up. I had an absolute blast. We're going to do it again next year. I had an absolute blast meeting people, talking to people, selling games, making some money. I'm not going to lie. Also, I had some trades. A couple of things I got. Splatterhouse. This is a Retro Limited. I have not opened it. And then I also got Gargoyles on the Sega Genesis. Uh, complete in box. This is one I've been looking for for a while. And uh, a little bit harder to find. So, yeah, pretty cool. Hey, buddy. I kind of like your head right there on my arm. Thank you. Wow. 
Just for you. <laughs> Thank you. Because you know why we're doing it? Because somebody ruined it. Oh, are you going to you freak. Are we going? No, we're... If you ever do that again, I will kill you in your sleep and when you're awake. Is that where we're going? Yes, we're going to freaking McAllister's because you ruined it! Woo! You Wait, ruined it! I thought we were going to Emo's. <laughs> what? You freaking ruined it! You ruined the tradition! I no. ruined this. You know what I did, Tony? You know what I know what? what I did? I saved Bubby. I made sure he didn't have to subject himself to this. <laughs> Your move. McAllister's. And we decided to go eat. We decided to go eat on our way home, and we go to McAllister's. You broke the tradition, and now I'm gonna break <coughs> you. Bobby, are you okay with the way things transpired today? It was a great day. Are you glad you're not having Jack in the Box? Yep, I am. Completed. The heaven I was in. It was really good, I liked it. It was, it's too expensive. It was delicious. What you get? But that's like, it's way more quality. Uh, I know what you can do say. It's the proper, it's the proper portion size that you should eat. Anyway. Tell us all our favorite movies are trash every single week. A grand and a half. I'm not happy about the Jack in the Box. I'm not doing it. You know do that? Bit. I'm gonna do a Ronnie. Bubby. Not with Bubby. Bubby. Here. No, Ron doesn't get to do it. He here. hasn't been here long enough. Here. He's been in my heart all along. What did I do to this show? <laughs> We're breaking I... traditions all around. What did I break tradition? He broke tradition. I didn't there's break. a there's a clause in the contract. The Stevie clause. When Stevie breaks traditions, it's all shattered. So it's all over? No. Oh my god. Do the thing so I can put the camera away. So Missouri Game Con 4, we're not done, we're going to VIP. Yeah, we know. Stevie, will you shove it? They can tell us you, the video still has like 10 minutes left. You have made me so mad today. Like madder than you ever made me mad before. I'm gonna rip your Are you more mad that. than NYR? Yes. This reminds me. I'm gonna get Jack in the Box before we go to Jack in the Box! I'm Stevie! That does sound a lot like me. What were you thinking? I enjoyed it. For about, you know, three or four hours out of it. <laughs> the other six were interesting. Bubby? Oh geez, that was scary. <laughs> Who? You. Me? Yeah, Bubby. Her? Wonderful. Did it bother you that I was selling? I had fun. <laughs> All right. So we're actually going to go to the VIP lunch, hangout time. The Missouri Game Con guests are going to be there. There's also going to be some arcade games set up. Hi, Bubby. Freaking VIP party. VIP party. Certain beverages there. I'm an adult, sir. And some food. And we go, and we have no idea where we're going. We have no idea where this thing's at. And we find it. There's actually a playground, and I do a playground chasing review. Ooh, playground chase. Look at that metal slide. No, go to the thing. We're not going. No. I'm not Stevie, going. I'm going. it's your vote. I'm staying in here. Let's go climb the spider web. Careful up there, buddy. Can you imagine Bubby in, in the car just being mad at us? Yeah. You know, us three are constantly mad at each other for different reasons. <laughs> Mostly it's you. The freaking FBI is going to track us down. You get on it first, and then... <laughs> this is this is very weird. There's a little seat up here and everything. <laughs> Go.
an 8.5 out of 10. Come check it out, St. Charles, Missouri. <laughs> Puppy's mad. You get caught what with a one sniff with those parents, and you're you're screwed. This is pretty. Like your face. Are you ready? Home run, woo! He's too fast, nobody can catch him. Hey Tony, how you feeling in there? Are you having fun? Hi, my name's George. Are you recording? No. Yes. Are you partying yet, Tony? This is a very weird angle for your face. Look up a little bit. About right there. <laughs> well, they're just gonna be a hobo. Like that one in Back to the Future Part 1. Drunk drivers. Drunk pedestrians. The FBI. It, Sunday is day two. It was, uh... Nope. <laughs> Not those. <laughs> Woo! Party. Yeah, that was funny. That's a good that's a good bit, as I say. Anime girl. I thought the event <laughs> I was a great having a great time. I was talking to the anime girl. <laughs> do you like your food, Bubby? Yeah, it's great. Oh, we, we do this for every food we eat. All right, we can stop now. Chicken. Yeah, there was a lot of choices, so everybody uh, figure out what he ate. A lot of chicken. Dude, I'm eating. <laughs> do it. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> Billy freaking Mitchell. Um, it was not bad, but. In retrospect, I wish they would have had it at uh, two plumbers this year like they did last year. We didn't go last year, but it still was a fun time. And uh, just, you know, kind of seeing Pat and Jay and Norm and uh, Brett Weiss was there and, yeah, a lot of other people. Uh, and I just got to hang out and talk. And it, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun fellowshipping and, and just hanging out with Bubby and Stevie and complaining. Afterwards, I wanted to go game chasing a little bit, but Stevie was whining and he wanted to get home. I'm Stevie. And I think Bubby was a little tired too. So there you have it. Missouri Game Con's in the books. Number four. Enjoyed it. Yeah, I had a blast. <laughs> we chased that chicken today, didn't we, Bubby? Uh-huh. Blood Brothers for life. So, in conclusion here, if you are ever, ever looking for a good game convention in Missouri, St. Charles, Missouri, and it's usually the first week in August, Missouri Game Con. And I just love the community, I love the people, I love the guests that they pull together. Yes, it's a smaller con, but I like it that way. And it's, it's only going to grow, it's only going to get bigger. And we're going to continue to go as long as we can. I'm going to go. I don't know about Stevie. Bubby and I'll go. The end. I'm done. Go suck an egg, Stevie. Freaking Jack in the Box. Bubby? <laughs> don't hit the Why would Oh, you... I hit the mic. Right here. <laughs> Bubby, you want to talk about how Tony sucks? I hate him. You know what? You know he tried to clean out that stupid room for the whole summer, and, and then the one freaking, week, the one we week busy. we're all doing we stuff, you get mad at us for not doing it, <laughs> for not helping him. And where are the bad guys? Where are the bad guys? How dare us? You know what? Go suck an egg. <laughs> what do you think of Pat's hair? Nice. What about my hair? <laughs> <laughs>